Hey guys, welcome to another video. So, uh, what I'm currently looking at here is USDCHF. Then I'll start on the daily chart and just explain each and everything for you guys. So, on the daily, we have this low here that we can use like as a point of value. And then as you can see, we just tapped that area. And then what I'm expecting is for the market to clearly push to the downside a bit. And then we have a descending channel. And then within that descending channel, we have mass psychology activation. And then we look for those buying opportunities on the lower time frame. So let's get to uh, analyzing properly. I was just explaining everything. So we have the overall descending channel like this. And then as you can see, using that uh, market nature, you'll see that this is a corrective move to the downside. And then it clearly states that when it's corrective at a higher value area you can expect a clear push to the upside so as you can see here we can just have like a clear push down in this point we have a push down and then this could be the larger corrective move so we can just take a uh, short-term buys from here to here on the 90 percent row so let's switch to a four hour chart so on the four hour what i'm currently expecting is that mass psychology area to be activated or be broken and then another scenario that I'm currently looking at is that we haven't broken, we haven't hit like the third touch just because we have our first touch here and then we have our second touch here and then we can expect the third touch here to clearly complete this overall pattern and then in that way we have that mass psychology activation. So we have two things in one on that one. Then so let me just uh, clearly uh, do this patterns here. And then let me just remove that indication whereby the market should break. And then let's switch to a hour chart. And then on the hour chart, that's where I'll be showing you the entries that I'm thinking to take on this one. So let me just bring this out. So like I said, I'm expecting the market to break that high, high psychology area. And then in that form, I'm expecting a corrective move in this type of fashion. And then we hit the third touch after hitting the third touch this would be the corrective move to the downside whereby you can take it on the break or you can take a risk entry so a risk entry is something of this nature you wait for a clear retracement candle or an engulfing candlestick and then you take the first candlestick and then you aim for the first take profit around here the second take profit it's at the 90 percent rule of which it would be like a 19% move uh, let me just check it would be like a 20% move and then another entry that you can take is whereby you wait for a clear push to the upside you get the first tight flag and then on that first tight flag you wait for six to eight hours one hour candles and then you get the first tight flag just like this and then you take your first entry on the break of structure so this is a buy stop you use a buy stop instead of a sell limit or a market execution you use a buy stop and then your first take profit it's this one here overall take profit for 10 percent and then this is just an inflection point whereby the market will just play will just impulse to the upside and then just play around in this point here whereby sometimes you can get like a tight flag in this point but i don't prefer anyone taking this one you can just take the first one around this point and then you move your stop loss to break even wait for the market to clearly push to the upside and then on the amber zone that's where you'll get the first larger flag in this point here whereby you can take the entry on the third touch or you can just wait and see if you can get like a tight flag within that uh, larger flag maybe at the top of the structure and then you aim for the overall take profit of which is the 90 percent rule so let's check this one here let's say you take like an entry just like this one on the third touch and then your stop loss is just slightly below here 84 pips would be fine and then your first take profit it's at about 7.7 percent .7%. and then yeah i hope you will uh, take a few trades on this one and then i'll see you on another video.